today, we will create a sales report, by year, region, store, product, and type of sale. We will use decomposition tree, and ribbon chart in this report. We will use DDC sales data, the link of workbook, is available in description below. The data covers 5 years, from 2001, to 2005. It contains 2 regions, 4 stores, 4 products, sold on each store, on cash and credit, and their sales value. Click on Get Data, to import the Excel file. Select Excel Workbook, and click Connect. Now select the Excel file you want to import, and click Open. Select the table, or sheet you want to import, and click Load. Your selected tables have been loaded, and are available in the Fields pane, at right corner. From Insert tab, select a text box, and create the report title. Save the report to your hard drive. Now drag the sale field, to an empty area, on the report, to create a new chart. Change the chart type, to a ribbon chart. Now add the region, store, product, and type of sale, on the x-axis, of the ribbon chart. Change the title of sales column, from sum of sales, to sales. Add a slicer to show yearly sales, instead of sales of all 5 years. Drags years field, onto the slicer, and change the type of slicer to list. Resize the slicer, to make room for other charts. Now create a decomposition tree to create a sales decomposition tree by region, store, product, and type of sale. Drag region, store, product, and type of sale fields, into the explain by area. Add region, store, product, and type of sale fields, to the branches, of decomposition tree as well.
resize the decomposition tree to make room for other charts. Add a column chart to show sales by stores. Add sales to the Y axis and store field to the X axis of the column chart. Change the year slicer to a drop down list and relocate it to the top of the report. Resize the sales by store, column chart, to make room for another chart. Add another column chart. Add sales to the Y axis, and product field to the X axis, of the column chart. Our sales report is complete. Please feel free to ask any question, or give your feedback, in the comments section below.